Ngaba Banga, who joins us now on the phone from the city. Good evening to you and thank you for your time. I mean, uh, quite uh, fast and furious developments today. Uh, good evening, Bogani, and good evening to your, to your viewers. Your response to what's unfolding at the council chambers at the moment? Uh, right now, there is an illegal meeting uh, uh, taking place uh, endorsed by the MEC um, uh, Casa, also by us uh, with, the, with the AMC. There's no city manager there in that meeting. There's no secretariat. Uh, in this old structure, uh, uh, a mock council, and uh, we're not taking it serious. Uh, uh, Mayor Trudget is still an executive mayor and his mayoral committee. Um, the municipal manager is not dead. The municipal manager is capable. Therefore, he cannot be uh, undermined in that particular fashion. The law does not uh, allow that. We are going to do everything uh, in our power to make sure that uh, instability does not come back in Nelson Mandela. We have um, um, a, 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 a he seized the membership of um, uh, Councillor Maniate because he publicly stated that he is leaving the DA. Institution of the DA allows us uh, for uh, an immediate uh, succession of membership. Therefore, um, we are confident that uh, we'll win this one as we've been winning uh, in the past. Uh, uh these are just disparate measures from the opposition to try. And, and turn things around in the metro in which they are not going to be able to do so. I mean, ultimately, with the removal of your speaker, Lawak, earlier this afternoon, there are those who would say you simply don't have the numbers at the moment. Uh, you're moving around technicalities, but you don't have the support uh, in that chamber. Now, uh, if uh, the, the speaker has been removed, now we'll have a 60-60 because we are going to fill the vacancy uh, immediately. Uh, because uh, uh, former councillor Maniati is no longer a member of the DEA, then we'll take it from there um, and deal with it. I mean, uh, is there particular poetic justice for the opposition that, as I understand it, uh, it's the former deputy mayor who, uh, at least from this gathering uh, at the moment, has been elected the new mayor? Um, there is no council meeting. I think uh, I must have put it very clear that the mayor of Nelson Mandela is uh, Mr. Ethel Trollip, uh, because that meeting is the municipal manager agenda meeting. In fact, he agenda it. You know, he declared the vacancy, and there's a vacancy. What we are going to do is to fill the vacancy and continue to stabilize the government and elect a speaker, and then uh, we'll proceed to the business of uh, the country as we are doing so. Were you given any warning that this meeting would take place this evening, that uh, the vote uh, would uh, be put forward as it has? Not at all. It's another technicality of the notice. If uh, the meeting is convened, uh, you must be able to be given notice. There was no notice. Uh, uh, these people are just doing uh, flouting the law, as they've uh, been doing uh, in the past. But we'll stick into the regulation. We'll stick with what is right in the Constitution and what is right in the constitution of the DA and do what is right for South Africans. But we're not going to let them uh, destroy what was built because Nelson Mandela right now as a speaker has become a construction site because the money is going to services. So as far as you're concerned, as the Democratic Alliance, this was an illegal meeting. As far as you're concerned, uh, Athol Trollope remains the mayor of Nelson Mandela Bay. What happens tomorrow? You can, do you, you mount some you can, kind of you legal see, challenge? You can see it for you. You can see it for yourself uh, that uh, in the chairs where the city manager sits, uh, there's no city manager in the chairs where they're taking minutes for the meeting. Nobody is taking minutes. Therefore, it's just an illegal meeting. And uh, we are not going to tolerate decisions of an illegal meeting. We are a constitutional state. We have to do things in a constitutional way. And um, um, we are focused and uh, we'll be doing our work as of uh, uh, tomorrow, and uh, the mayor will be in his office and doing the work. And uh, whatever they try to do, we'll, we'll do everything in our power, which is legal, to make sure that we stop them. Are you working with the local authorities, local law enforcement agencies? If you say this meeting is illegal, uh, can it be allowed to continue? Uh, of, of, 
the meeting is illegal. We are not going to chase any person in the council chamber. Uh, I told you that this is a mock candidate. If they want to practice how to be mayors, they can do so. Uh, but the mayor of uh, the city is Mr. Ethel Trollip, the law. He was elected procedurally and correctly. And unfortunately, you can see it for yourself in your own streams that really this is not a, an, an ordinary council meeting where the processes are being followed. The, uh, a shame of a council meeting. Therefore, we are focused on the BIO between government. I, I, I rest assured uh, we are going to win this one again. All right, we'll have to leave it there with the leader of the Democratic Alliance in the Eastern Cape, Ngaba Bangal. This is obviously a developing story. It is a breaking news story at the moment. Uh, Nelson Mandela Bay Mayor Athel Trollope voted out in a motion of no confidence. His party says it's an illegal gathering. They are saying he remains the mayor in that metro.